and it's Bonnie. I am back. Happy Thursday. I think I'm declaring today uh, Purple Day. <laughs> I've got my pink purple tie-dye on for the first time today because the weather is so cool. I am loving it. And check it out. I am just burned. Oh my gosh, you guys. The Kringle Candle Blackberry Buttercream, which is absolutely delicious. I got to talk about this one. And the new 100% uh, soy wax. So for those of you just joining me, I am a Kringle Candle Ambassador, which means Kringle did provide me this candles free of charge. And if you use the code Queen Geek, uh, you'll get 15% off of your order. So I wanted to kind of go over the difference uh, between the 100% soy wax and the paraffin wax. And I have a photograph for you guys that I took. I'll put a screenshot up in a minute. But I decided to burn blackberry buttercream today because I, I, I've heard this one is very um, like a nutty buttercream. And um, what I heard is correct <laughs> because it is. So let me go over the scent notes in this one. And then I'm going to talk a little bit about the wax. So um, each of the Kringle candles has a scent story. So if you're online and you click on details, you're going to see about the actual candle wax, the wicks. Then if you click on scent story, you're going to find out a little bit more about the, um, the scent notes. So Blackberry buttercream, it's all about the buttercream. I got to agree with that. Um, it is butter, nutty, spicy cinnamon, chestnut, roasted, sweet milk, maple cream. <laughs> How awesome is that? It's funny because I really don't get any blackberry in this candle. It's not fruity at all. Basically a nutty buttercream scent but it's wonderful. It's really strong. I think the new soy wax is a lot stronger than the paraffin. I mean, even smelling this cold. Wow. So I actually had this burning for a couple of hours in the kitchen. Um, it was almost too strong. I had to move it to my larger room. So those of you that like a really strong throw, I think you're going to love this one. Um, as for me, I tend to like candles that are about in the middle. Um, one of the other new soy candles for fall is the Northern Lights. How pretty is this label, by the way? Um, this is like a eucalyptus scent. I know this is going to be way too strong for me. <laughs> um, but if you like the stronger candles, I think the soy wax is going to be something that uh, you really like. So I'm going to put a screenshot up. Um, the photo on the left. Let me grab my phone just to make sure because I took the photo. Um, the photo on the left is the new 100% soy uh, wax. And then the photo on the right is the paraffin. And you can kind of see the difference a little bit. Um, the soy wax, it looks a lot denser. It is a bright white. Whereas the paraffin looks a little bit more translucent. It's a little bit ripply on top. Um, I don't know if you can see on my camera, you guys. I'm going to try and do this. So this is the soy wax right here. And then this one is the paraffin. You can kind of see the difference on camera here. And what I've noticed is the soy is very tightly packed. Um, they're a little bit lower than the paraffin, I think just because of the way um, the wax settles when it pours. And when you get your Kringle candle, um, the wicks are really, really long. Um, you're going to want to trim your wick. I actually use um, my handy dandy wick trimmer here. And then I trim these down um, to about like a half inch or so. And then um, you'll get a better burn on that if you trim the wicks down. So that's what I did with my blackberry buttercream here. And um, like I said, I love the burn on this one. I feel like the soy does burn a lot cleaner. Um, I really like the aroma. It was very natural. If I go to the details on this one, um, fragrance oil, maximum potency fragrance made with natural ingredients extracted from compounds in New Jersey, Florida, Georgia, Texas, and Missouri. So it's all USA. Uh, burn time up to 100 hours. I've kind of been testing out these soy candles. I do feel like they burn longer than the paraffin. Um, 100% soy, natural, biodegradable, clean burning, non-toxic soy wax refined in North America. And the wicks are 100% natural 
cotton fiber. And it's so funny, the jars, you guys, 100% recyclable, um, sustainable glass jar from Ohio. Yay. <laughs> Yay. Shout out to Ohio. So I had this one burning, like I said, in my kitchen. Um, as these cool down, the soy wax definitely looks a little bit different than the paraffin or the um, like a soy blend. Um, it looks a little bit grainier on top, but then once these, um, I can't stop smelling this, you guys, uh, once they cool down um, and they completely solidify, um, they're going to look, you know, pretty much like um, just the plain white wax again. But I kind of wanted to point that out because a lot of times people will ask, well, what's the difference between the soy and the paraffin? I've always liked paraffin candles, but I do feel like um, I'm starting to get a little bit more excited about the soy. I like the clean burn. I like that they're burning um, like longer. They feel like they get a nice, they're a slower burn. Um, and I also like the fragrance. The fragrance seems a lot stronger to me. I burned probably about five or six now of the soy candles and the throws have been really good on these. So I'm super excited. Um, like I said, the butter, the blackberry buttercream is an interesting candle because like I said, it's a little bit more buttercream nutty um, than it is like fruity blackberry. You get kind of an essence of blackberry. I don't know if it's just because of the label or I'm actually smelling it, but um, you're definitely going to get pure on nutty buttercream. Oh my gosh, this smells so good though. To me, this is a fall candle, seriously. It smells like fall, you guys. And you know how much I've been into fall today. Like I'm on fall overload. So like I said, um, I am a Kringle Candle Ambassador. And if you use the code QueenGeek, 15% uh, off of your order. And I did get um, these candles for free. But oh my gosh, check out that label. I love the purple. It's funny. I'm trying to think, is this like a, I don't know what that is in the background. I'm like, are those flowers? Because <laughs> or could this be a full-on holiday fall candle? I don't know. I'm calling it a holiday fall candle because I like the scent so much. <laughs> so anyway, I will be back. I'm going to continue to review more of these um, soy candles from Kringle. Like I said, this one, I think this one's going to be a little bit overpowering for me. I love the label though. Northern Lights, how pretty is that? So anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'll be back tomorrow. Bye-bye.